You're watching Funny or Die TV. Boop, boop, boop. Here's the first clue. A stream. Or a... River. Less, less rapid than a river. A creek. All right. <laughs> this is amazing! Please welcome Tig Notaro. Hi, welcome to Under a Rock with Tig Notaro. I'm Tig Notaro. I don't watch many TV shows or films, so I'm really bad at recognizing famous people. And on this show, I interview famous people to try to figure out who they are. Please welcome this person. Hi. I've never, I've never been on a talk show. I've seen more trepidation from the host. Wait, oh, I thought you oh, said you've never it. been on a talk show. No, 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 I've, I've, yeah. yeah. Really nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, I'm Tig. <laughs> this, is, this is my talk show. Awesome. Yeah. I don't mean to objectify you, but you're a handsome man. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh, I mean, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, uh, how do you know who I am? Your stand-up. I know, but how do you, oh, so you've seen my stand-up it, it was the Largo oh, okay. one that first came to my attention. Sure. And I was like, wow, this is... Not funny. <laughs> it was so brave. I love big swings. Are you, are you doing okay? As far as I know today, yes. I'm doing well, but my body gives out with no warning. <laughs> okay. Your face has been a popular internet meme. This is true. Um, can you make the face? Should we make the face? Yeah, I, yeah, I don't know it. Okay. Alexa, drum roll. Okay. <laughs> and what is that, why that's, that's, that's people are going nuts over this yeah did you have an idea when you made that is it from uh your job i had zero idea when it was happening that it, that, that was that i be... was going to be brought up 22 years later yeah oh it's 22 years it's ago it's about that yeah wow okay it's about that how old are you i'm 40 i'll be 42 in oh, about okay. a week all right March. Yep. I'm March as Wait, well. What day? 24th. On the 8th. We need to have a double birthday. A Pisces <laughs> celebration. We should. And do you believe in that kind of stuff? You know, I thought it was the biggest bunch of bullshit until I met somebody. Please don't talk like that. I'm sorry. <laughs> you thought it was I thought it hogwash. Was, I thought it was a bunch of BS until yeah. I met somebody who, based on nothing other than my birth date down to the minute, knew things that were ungoogleable. Like what? Pretty personal stuff. Like I said, it's ungoogleable for a reason. This isn't gonna air it's... anyway. <laughs> Here's another fun fact about you. Okay. You once needed a police escort to appear in public. That's true. Who are you? <laughs> That's what I was really wondering at the time, at that point in time. Is it because what you, your job was going really well? Yes. Really? Yeah. Are you a superhero? No, I'm not a superhero. Now, here's what I'm going to ask of yeah. you. I would like to get clues from you. Okay. okay. Yeah, they're over there. All right. Um, all right, here's the first clue. A stream. Or a? River. Less, less rapid than a river. A creek. All right. This is amazing. I want to hold on to this because okay, you hold this on. is funny to me. Okay. And let's see another clue. Okay. What what else you got? We got. Have you seen this or did you? I have seen this. Okay. Bus shovel bird. <laughs> <laughs> Am I saying the right words? No. So we have this, and we have. Bus shovel, shovel bird. bird. <laughs> okay, bus dig. Bus dig beak. Am I closer? Yes, you got one of the three. Dig. Bus beak. Dig the beak. Can I change my name right now? Is this your name? Yes. This is your name. That is my name. Car. No. Bus. No. Van. Van dig beak? 
<laughs> what am I missing? Van Vanderbeek? You're Vanderbeek. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know your first name. That's Can okay. Can you give me three first names and I'll guess? Okay, we've got give James, me... okay. Brad, and Craig. Okay, I feel like your name is James. Is your name James yes. Vanderbeek? Yes. Sir. Okay. <laughs> I've I've heard that name. Okay. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> okay. We did it. We did it. Um, all right. Even though I figured this out with no problem. Yes. I'm gonna do a proper introduction. Okay. For you. Sounds good. Um, he has inspired a generation of screaming fans playing the heartthrob Dawson Leary on the. Okay, this is where this comes in. <laughs> you were Darson, Dawson Leary in the, in the w, WB series Dawson's Creek. Yes. Most recently, he starred in What Would Diplo Do? Mm -hmm. And Ryan Murphy's hit FX series Posse. Pose. <laughs> Pose. 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 <laughs> So it turns out my guest today was James Van Der Beek. <laughs> James, I love you, sir. <laughs> Same, right back Thanks so you. much for being on. Absolutely. And uh, I can't wait to watch Posse. I can't <laughs> believe. <laughs> I think it's really wonderful and exciting that we're both March birthdays. And Alexa, could you sing happy birthday to Tig and James Vanderbeek? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. James Vanderbeek. Tig Guitar. Happy Tarla. birthday to you. Sir. And many more. Wait, there's no paint on this brush. My trophy case yeah. is full because I'm such a good mom. A good mom. Do you have a podcast? <laughs> <laughs> Please welcome Tig Notaro. Hi, welcome to Under a Rock with Tig Notaro. I don't watch a lot of TV or films, so I have a hard time recognizing famous people. And on this show, I interview famous people to try and figure out who they are. So please welcome this person. Hey. Uh, hi. You're Tig. I am. Yeah. Hi. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for being here. Yeah, you're excited, aren't you? I am. I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I do too. I, I appreciate you being here. Uh huh. Um, I. Uh, Me. What's that? Me. You. You. Us Just together. Just being here. Yeah. Uh huh. Why? Why would you do a show like this? I'm a fan of yours. <laughs> Thank you. I like you. Even if you don't know who I am, I like you. I like you too. I don't know who I am. <laughs> now, here's a fun fact about you. Uh huh. Your great 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 grandfather was the mayor of Pittsburgh. That is correct. Do you know my great great grandfather was the mayor of New Orleans? So we're practically related. Practically. <laughs> um, are you from Pittsburgh? No. <laughs> You've had a pacemaker since your early 20s. I know exactly who you are. I am. Oh, this doesn't tell me anything. <laughs> Why do you have a pacemaker? I don't, I don't really know. Really? Was, yeah. No, I just had some weird con heart thing and they fixed it. Do you want to feel it? Really? Yeah. Well, because I had a double mastectomy and this side of my chest <sighs> goes, like, really yeah, goes yeah, yeah. in. Okay, so uh, you, you see, mine is right there. It's not. Feel that? Yeah. yeah, make the face, make yeah. the face. Yeah, it's like having a matchbox in there. Like, yeah. Do you want to fill? Yeah, I, I mean, why not? Oh, that's not bad. 
Well, that's, that's not, not bad either. This isn't a competition. Okay. All right. I mean, we're both dying. <laughs> we both have suffered. Have you? No. Oh. <laughs> really, no. I mean... I feel like you're an actor. Actress, actress. Um, uh huh. I have little props in here. Let's see. What, what have you got? I have this. Were you doing some algebra? Well, I was gonna see if uh -huh. you could draw a picture of what you do at your job. <laughs> Alexa, can you give us a thirty-second timer? Thirty seconds, starting now. I'm gonna try. I'm not a very good artist. Are you a good artist? I mean, my mother was an artist. My grandmother was. But an you artist. were not. Well, no, I also, but I don't want to... Toot your own horn? Right. I don't have any artists in my family. I think this, I think you're really going to get it. Right here. I'm sorry, but your time is up. Alexa, stop. Um, you sit on a couch. I, that's, I'm, people recognize me on a couch. Wait, are Thank you a talk show host? No. So people recognize you from a couch. Oh. Are you a YouTube star? No. Okay. Here's what I want to ask you. Mm -hmm. I want to ask for some clues that you can give me. Okay. Let's see. You have a little bucket there? I have a little bucket. <laughs> This is supposed to help me. <laughs> Technically. Did you bring this from home? I sure did not. But it does reference my name. It is... Bo? Correct. Your name is Bo. <laughs> okay, so this is your Bo. Bo is part of the name. Bo. It's, a, it's one of the syllables. That's it. <laughs> What do you usually shoot with? Arrow. Right, but then what's the phrase? Bowen. Bowen? That's your name? Bowen? <laughs> what's special about the bow? Look at it, look at it, Tig. What's on it? What makes it jewels. special? Jewels. Bowen Jewels. <laughs> <laughs> your name is Bowen Jewels. Almost. <laughs> Swap them around. Jewel and bows. Jewel and bows. That's got to be it. I I figured out your name. What is that? Jules Bowen. So I mean, almost. Can I tell her? No, it's, no. You're so close. I mean, it's like you're you're right there. Okay. Do you have another clue? Oh. Mm. Mm. My trophy wait. case yeah. is full. Right. Because I'm such a good mom. A good mom. Do you have a podcast? <laughs> I'm just, I'm picturing you on a couch. Like, hi, it's Jules Bowen. Welcome to Mom Talk. I, Jules Bowen, I feel like you're not Jules Bowen. And I give up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and, um, and open the reveal. Okay. Alexa, can I get a drum roll, please? Okay. She's won four SAG awards. That's amazing. <laughs> Two Emmys <laughs> and a Critics Choice Award for her starring role as Claire Dunphy. <laughs> they should make every big-headed actor sit here and just go like, is it Dunfree? How do you say it? Yeah. Is it Dunfree? Dunfee, Dunfee, yeah, Dunfee, Dunfee. 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 On ABC's longest-running comedy series. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, Modern Family, uh -huh. which also uh -huh. happens to be Michelle Obama's favorite show. Yeah. Huge accomplishment. <laughs> Modern Family has received 22 Emmys and will soon return for its 11th and final season. <laughs> Turns out my guest today was Julie Bowen. <laughs> Thanks for being here, Julie Bowen. I'm going to go by Jules now. <laughs> Thank you
You're watching Funny or Die TV. And now, the shirtless painter. Oh, well, looks like I ran out of room uh, for the Y there, and that's okay. You know what I like to say? There are no screw-ups, only pleasant whoopsies. Great. And if anyone's seen my son, please let me know. And hip hop, when someone says a line, mm -hmm. which we wish that we caught on to, we say bars. Bars. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if we was chilling with Shakespeare and he was like, to be or not to be, we'd be like, bars. bars. <laughs> Please welcome Tig Notaro. Hi, welcome to Under a Rock with Tig Notaro. I don't watch a lot of TV or movies, so I have a really hard time recognizing a lot of famous people. This talk show is me interviewing famous people and trying to figure out who they are. Please welcome this person. Hi. Hi. Hi, I'm this person. How are you? I'm good. You good? How are you? I'm good. All right. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Thank you. I'm a little nervous. Are you? Yeah. So backstage, there was a, a woman from India, and she gave me this. She said, wear this for good luck. Okay. So this is supposed to, like, like, make me just completely... Well, now I feel nervous. <laughs> Do you want my beads? Yes. I got you. I'm telling you, this thing balances you out. It cheese up. All right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's not working. <laughs> It's not. It's not. It worked for me, though. Do you want you want him back? Yeah, though, yeah. Right? I'll rock him back. <laughs> and what do the bracelets on your hand do? Anything in particular? Um, well, these two are real special. I got them from a friend. Uh -huh. This, I was just at the mall, and I was like, "This is cool." What Simple. mall do you shop at? Um, I shop in Jersey, Willowbrook Mall. That's crazy. I lived in Texas for a bit as a kid, and um. The mall we went to was called the Willowbrook Mall. Oh, see? Can't even make that up. I'm and sure. are you from New Jersey? Originally, no. OK. Yeah. Where are you originally from? Haiti. Haiti? Yeah, Haiti. Wow. Yeah. OK. I was born in the slums. Were you? Mm hmm It's so funny. I always tell my daughter that I grew up. Uh-huh. No electricity. Yeah. No clean water. And I took a donkey to school. Rode one or just took one with you? <laughs> Sometimes I rode it. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Sometimes I, I took it. We used to play a game uh -huh. in, in this village Pin in the Haiti. tail? No, not that one, because I was in Haiti. It was just different. Yeah. It was, the game was called We Going to America. So I'd get on a donkey, and the kids would wave. And we, I'd go around the cemetery and come back, and they'd be like, what did you bring us from America? Yes. That's how we escaped that whole poverty thing. Wow. Through that's... imagination, you know? And do you, are you happy to be here? I love it. I love it. I thought you said I love you when you said I love it. <laughs> and I, I... Je t'aime. I don't know what you're saying. I just said I love you in French. I'm French, but I don't speak French. It's okay, but you're still French. Je t'aime. Do you speak French? Oui, moi, je parle français. No. <laughs> Where's your donkey now? Dead. On that, I'm going to um, ask you some questions. Well, first of all, why did you come on this show? I have to imagine it's a weird phone call. Not really. No, okay, so this is normal. No, it's normal. It's quite amazing. What is amazing? To be with a person. Uh huh who's just having a conversation with you. That's Feel right. me? I do. Dap up. And so you just... Dap up. Dap. Oh. Dap. So when you say dap up, it's one. 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 Dap up. That's all. Swag. Dap up? Yep, swag. Can I do it? <laughs> but sit back like you're not expecting it. Dap up. Swag. And then you say swag after? Yeah, you got to throw swag. Okay. Have it come from the stomach, though. Okay. Swag. Dap up. Swag. Facts. You're an interesting fellow. If you didn't have the job you have now, what, what would you be doing? I'd probably be an incredible music teacher. Okay. And then, as you can see, 
from the physicality if I needed to make money. A stripper! Uh, wanna, 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 uh, wanna? See, I'm from the islands, baby. <laughs> you feel me? Like, mm. So you would teach music or strip? I could actually do both. Are you a musician? That. Yes. Is that your, how you make your money? For sure. I feel like I might be on to you. When I'm hearing I'm on to you, I'm on to you, I'm on to you, it sound like a song. I'm on to you, I'm on to you, I'm on to you, sound like a song. I'm on to you, I'm on to you, I'm on to you, it sound like a song. I'm on to you, on to you, on to you, sound like a song. I'm on to you, on to you, on to you. See, I could just make shit up. You see what I'm saying? Fuck that, man. You feel me? Ah, fuck. This is telling me you can do a handstand, and after everything you've done, I have no doubt you can do a handstand. Do I do a handstand here? Is that okay? You want me to do it? This is the only place. Okay, let's do it right here. You ready? Yeah, baby, get in the groove. Get in the groove. Get in the groove. Get in the groove. Get in the Mouth, mouth. That was, uh, that was really, really incredible, especially <laughs> reflecting again on you saying you were at all nervous. <laughs> I was, this really you, helped me. <laughs> it seems like once you're beyond your nerves, I told you that. anything can happen. Alexa, give me a round of applause. Okay. Do you have, I know the guitar is a clue, but do you have any other clues about yourself here? So here's a poem that mm -hmm. I, 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 I did for you just to give you a clue. Right, you ready? Yes. Ready or not, here I come. The fact that you don't know me is killing me softly. So I'm just going to leave and I'll be gone to November. I'll be gone to November. I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Alexa, drum roll, please. Okay. You can't pretend like you're not from the Fuji's. This three-time Grammy Award winning artist first made a splash on the music scene as a member of the most famous hip hop groups of all time, the Fuji's. I knew it, I knew it. I hope you have on camera how many times I said I was on to this guy. He then moved, and I haven't been on to a single guest so far, but I haven't had any musicians. He then moved on to a thriving solo career and collaborated on hit records with musical icons including Santana, Shakira, Lil Wayne, Paul Simon, Gloria Estefan, and Destiny's Child. This year, he released a new mixtape entitled Why Clef Goes Back to School. Turns out my guest today I'm just gonna call you Y Club. I guess you got me. I did. <laughs> I got you. Alexa, how do you say thank you in French? Thank you. In French is, je vous remercie. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Thank you. What if Martin Luther stepped in the room, never stepped foot in the balcony? What if they had a bulletproof car instead of a drop top for Kennedy? Malcolm X did this speech. What if I sat amongst the congregation? So when the boys scream, get your hands out my pocket, I fire shots at the assassins. Now I know you don't know me, but peep this, ain't nothing new under the sun. What if I had put blanks in Marvin Gaye's father's gun? Bars. Facts. <laughs> <laughs>